Hey there. You have purchased one of the magical infusion sets from The Cauldron, which means that you're gonna be able to spend the next couple of minutes watching me make an infusion and make a cocktail. We're going to be doing a Lapsang and black pepper uh, vodka infusion, and then we're gonna make a delicious spiced and smoky Moscow mule out of this. So this is what comes in your kit. Uh, we've got a couple of other things. We've got some filters and some funnels as well. Uh, but for now, you're just gonna be using this little thing right here. Now this is our black pepper and lapsang tea infusion. Grab yourself a funnel and uncork your bottle. And then you're gonna take your, um, your vodka, which I've already poured out for us here, now you're going to want to use a, a clean tasting vodka, nothing with any flavours, um, so a low to middling quality vodka. And then pour this in here. Wonderful. Pop a cork on the top, give it a quick shake. And then you're gonna leave this somewhere in your house. Leave it at room temperature, somewhere dry, somewhere out of direct sunlight for about two days. And don't forget to label it so that people know what it is you've got there. Okay, so you've had this infusing now for about 48 hours. Uh, what you're gonna to need to do is just uncork it and filter this stuff out. Uh, now you can use a coffee filter for this, but you've got quite large granules in here, so it might just be easier to use a sieve. Pour it straight through there. There we go, that's great. And we've got our infusion lying in the bottom there now. Everything that you've got left in here, you can just discard that. You're also gonna to need to give your bottle a rinse out because we've still got a couple of little things in there. So just give that a quick rinse. Once you've got a now clean infusion bottle, grab yourself a funnel and just pour the infusion right back in. So now we've got ourselves a wonderful lapsang and black pepper infused vodka. Once you've got your fully infused spirit, we're gonna make ourselves a lovely Moscow meal with it. So you're gonna take 50 milliliters of your infused spirit. That's one large on the double side. There we go. Pop a lid back on that, leave it outside. Uh, about 15 mils of lime juice. So that's less, just about around half of your small one. There you go, pop that in there. And one dash of Angostura bitters. There we go. Top it up all the way to the top with ice. Now a lot of people will make their cocktails less ice because they don't want as much water in it but actually the more ice you put in the quicker it gets cold the less your ice melts last of all take your ginger beer pour it over the top and there you have smoked and spicy moscow milk.